Hey guys, I'm Dev back with another Affinity Photo tutorial. Today I will show you how to create a beautiful charcoal portrait effect in Affinity Photo. At first, select your image and make a copy of it by Ctrl J Copy. Select copy image and then go to adjustment black and white. Now this is an affinity photo default black and white. I already uploaded the best black and white photo effect preset in affinity photo. You can check that video on this channel playlist or I will put the link in this video description. You can pause this video and check that black and white effect preset video. Now here I am using my black and white preset, adjustment, scroll down, black and white and first three affinity photo defaults and the fourth one my preset. So I am using this one. Now right click and merge visible as I make it in a one layer and rest crash or delete it. Select black and white image and make a copy of it by Ctrl J copy. Now press Ctrl I as invert. Change blend mode to color dodge. Now go to right side below, select Life Filters and select Gaussian Blur. Check Preserve Alpha and feel free check your Gaussian Blur radius. Here I am using 30% PX and OK. Select both layers and right click and merge visible as make it in a one layer and rest, trash or delete it or make Ctrl G as put in a group folder. Now select charcoal black and white image and go to left top tone mapping persona. And here feel free and check these presets one by one for your image. We need little bit details of the image. So here I am using dynamic. Now to create a new white background, go to top, layers, new fill layer. And place this white layer background just bottom of the current image. Now select the image and add mask on it. While mask as a selection, press Ctrl I invert from your keyboard. Now this one looking like a white background only, but the image is still there, don't worry, under as a mask on this white background. So when we brush on it, image will came out from the white background. Now select paint brush tool, hardness 0, make a foreground color white and gently brush on it like this. Now few additional to make this artwork more good. Here I am using canvas texture. You can find it on Google search. Place this grey canvas texture on this image.
and change blend mode to multiply. Also reduce opacity to 20 to 25. Now few more adjustment levels. Select all layers and put it in a group folder by Ctrl G. Take a snapshot or right click merge visible as make it in one layer. Few more adjustment. Top menu, filters, sharpen, unsharp mask to give a sharpness of the image. Now few additional text to give a pro look. That's it. This is my final output. I hope you find this video helpful. If you like my work with Affinity Photo, then subscribe this Affinity Vibe YouTube channel to get more amazing Affinity Photo video tutorials. You can support me on my Instagram account link in video description and also you can check out the other amazing video just waiting for you in this channel playlist. Thanks for watching and I will back with another video soon. Till then, keep practicing cause practice makes us perfect and have fun with Affinity Photo.